Hey everybody, Ogre here again for Ogre Breaks, doing a little box opening. I got two of the hanger boxes of Topps Heritage 2022 Baseball. Uh, I finally saw these in some store uh, in a Walmart today. Uh, they do have the exclusive um, 1973 Topps Comics. Um, so, we'll, you know, we'll see. Maybe we can get lucky with pulling one, maybe two of those. I kind of, I, I like the idea of the comics, actually. Uh, 35 cards uh, per box. Uh, 11.98. Um is the cost of these at Walmart. And here are the odds, in case anybody wants to see the odds, which I, I will admit, I am very bad at showing the odds. So 35 cards, see if we get lucky for maybe a short print. Um, it would be nice if we can maybe get a nice little chrome pull or something like that. Or even, like I said, some of those comic cards are kind of nice. They were selling for some decent money at one point. Um, I think the Wander Franco one goes for about 23 or so dollars currently. Um, that may, I mean, I know when I checked a day or so ago, uh, that's the price it was going for. It might have gone down since then, but, uh, so figured, you know, definitely open up, you know, at least two of the hangers. I, I got the only two hangers that were left, so, um, most likely I probably would have bought a third maybe, but I don't know. Let's we'll give it a go. Like I said, um, 35 cards, so be, you know, definitely a quick little opening today, but Dustin Garneau. Ryan Jeffers, Jeff McNeil, Austin Meadows, James Ca uh, Caprellini, or Caprellian, Caprellian, excuse me, Trent Grisham, Soroka, Josh Rojas, Lance McCullers, Josh Naylor, Cantley Jansen, Avisel Garcia, Danzy Swanson, Corey Dickerson, Ryan Presley, Romy Gonzalez, then we got pitchers, 2020, 2021 rookie pitchers, Austin Warren, Connor Green, and Glenn Otto. Michael Taylor, Mike Zanino, Willie Adamas, Christian Javier, Sean Murphy, Moustakis, Makata, Goodrum, and we do get one of the comics, Clemente, New Age Performer, Shane Boz. Okay, not quite the Ray we're looking for, but still, I'll take it. Uh, Zach McKinstry, Rich Hill, Boyhood's Photos of Stars, Mike Trout, Suarez, Verlander, Castro, Hernandez hits the side it, and Abraham Toro. So, not bad. Able to get Shane Boz, New Age Performers. Like I said, I'm glad, I'll gladly take it. Definitely um, somebody who I'm going to be kind of watching this year. I know, I believe he got hurt. Uh, was in spring training, I believe. But, um, you know, definitely nice young pitcher for the Rays. And like I said, these comic cards, I do like them actually this year. Um, Something different, for sure. Um, in case you haven't seen them at all. I'm in the back. Um, but yeah, I, I do like these. The Clemente one I have pulled already. Uh, I don't know how many are in the set. Uh, I believe this one is number 25 in the set, so there's at least 25 of them. Um, I've only pulled... I know we've did some openings uh, with... Um, uh, Heritage this year. I, I've pulled about six or seven of them, I believe. And, uh, you know, probably the biggest name one we we pulled was probably Otani. I did pull the Alonzo one twice, I believe, uh, as well. And then I know we pulled the Bo Bichette, we pulled uh, Miggy, Salvador Perez. There may have been one other one we might have pulled in a, a live break. Or, but I know for myself, I've pulled the Clemente and... Uh, I've pulled the Alonzo, so, but, all right, let's see what we get, second box, I mean, overall, not a, I mean, it was a decent first box with the, the two hits, uh, you know, that we got, but, uh, overall, the, uh, you know, the other base rookies and stuff like that, nothing wild, but, Wario Faro, Steven Metz, DJ Peters, Jesus Lazardo, Sosa, Matt Barnes, Nico Horner, uh, Swanson's Blast ties in the seventh. Tony Santolin, Escobar, Reed Detmers. Okay, not too bad. Adam Duvall, Kalanick. Uh, what we got? Uh, Wins leaders, uh, Urias and Garrett Cole. Do we get a Duran? Okay, Max Kepler, Yager Molina, Pavon Smith. All right, Lars Newtbar as well. So at least this one we're hitting some, you know, the bigger name uh, rookies. Merrifield, Stan. Altuve uh, hit Historic's 22nd postseason home run. Jackson Kowar, rookie. Ian Happ, Christian Yelich. We do get a short print. Uh, we get Omar Navarez. 
Then we have a flashback, uh, 1973 Battle of the Sexes tennis match. Then we got Justin Turner, Alec Mills, Lamonte Wade, Frank Schwindel, Alex Verdugo, Starling Marte, Rugnan Odor, and Joey Wendell. So, not, not horrible for the, you know, just for having two hangers. Definitely could have been way worse. You know, of course, would have been nice if we can pull a wander, but um, with there being a 400 card checklist and then a 100 card short print set, I knew it was going to be extremely tough pulling a uh, wander. Um, I definitely didn't think we were going to pull one, honestly. So, um, but overall, I'm pretty happy with what we did pull out of this. The, the second box, probably a little bit better than the first overall. But like I said, the, the career highlight card of uh, Clemente comic strip is pretty sh nice looking. Shane Boz, and then, you know, we did do, do okay with the rookies, um, you know, with the second box, so, but with that, you know, if you liked what you saw, greatly appreciate you leave a like on the video, leave any comments regarding Heritage, let me know what your favorite version of uh, retail Heritage is to open, do you prefer these hangers, the fat packs, the blasters, I know the mega boxes are out there at on Target's website, um, I haven't personally purchased a, a mega box of Heritage yet, I've been actually kind of waiting to see if the Walmart ones have appeared yet. Um, I liked Walmart's version last year where they had the chrome opposed to the red paper parallel that you get in Targets. Um, so I'm going to definitely be waiting for some of the uh, the Walmart ones uh, to see if I can get lucky with some of those. Um, but, uh, I, I, you know, if, I, if, if they don't come out, I, I will definitely open up at least one mega uh, from Target. But, uh, you know, definitely let me know what your favorite version of retail is to open. I always like to hear from you guys what you think is, you know, the best way to kind of, you know, tackle retail, you know, so to say. And uh, if you haven't subscribed, greatly appreciate it. Subscribe. Hit that notification bell for any of my future uploads. And also do follow me on Instagram if you're ever looking to get into any of my live breaks. I try to do some breaks, too, maybe three times a week, uh, depending on my schedule. Um, and depending also too on what product is out there, um, you know, we occasionally do some, you know, retail breaks. We also do some hobby box breaks. So, uh, it always depends on, you know, what's kind of floating out there, what's worth opening up in my opinion. Um, you know, and I'm usually only doing breaks with stuff that I personally, you know, would open myself. Um, so you can always follow my Instagram if you're ever looking to get into any of my live breaks. And, uh, with that, I want to thank you guys, um, you know, again for watching, we're just a, a, a few shy of 2,500 uh, subscribers, so, um, you know, pretty excited to, you know, hit, you know, 2,500 subscribers, so definitely, I just want to also take a, you know, quick moment to, you know, say thanks to all you guys that have subscribed, that supported the channel, that comment, like the videos, watch the videos, participate in my live streams, if it's, um, you know, being in the break or just hanging out and chat, just want to say thank you, you know, I, um, didn't expect the channel to grow as much as it did in this past, uh, you know, roughly year and a half, a little over a year and a half. So, um, you know, just want to take a moment then just to say thank you again. So, but with that, thanks again for watching guys. Appreciate it and hope you enjoy the video.